Hey, it's JC1424 once again with Need for Speed Most Wanted in this fourth part of the series. We're going to go up against Blacklist rival number 12, Isabel Diaz, nicknamed Izzy. She drives a Mazda RX-8, just like our girl Mia. I don't know why only women drive the RX-8. It's not really that much of a feminine car. Heck, Mia should be driving a Miata, because that would make sense. Says Izzy's strength is lap knockout races. We cannot have a knockout race against her specifically, because you need a, four racers, not just two. And her bio. Izzy is definitely a chick you don't want to mess with. She knows everything there is about cars, on and off the road. She's got her... Ride wired tight. That made no sense. She comes from a long line of race fanatics. Everybody she runs with is either a cousin, friend, or uncle. They all stick close, so don't get on her bad side. Well, then that leads me to believe her reputation and her belief of how great she is at racing comes purely from family. And they're not going to be honest. <laughs> or maybe they would. I don't know. Here is the Blacklist Rival movie. Got me some cocoa to drink. I actually like the paint job on her RX-8 more than Mia's. It's, it just looks more cool. It takes up more of the car, more wild. At the same time, I kind of wish Izzy's was entirely red, not uh, mostly silver and then with a little red. And of course, I can click the select button. We can view her car. Oh my God, that's a big ass to make up for the fact she's anorexic and doesn't have one. <laughs> oh, look at these green, aqua, bluish windows. I, I see a little bit of blue in there, kind of. And at the end of the last episode, we went and bought ourselves a Clio Renault V6, and we got this uh, nice Cablazin uh, contest winner's paint job, the blue rims, dark blue windows, the, the, the carbon hood. Okay, now, obviously, the car is in stock, basically. I think they gave us a unique transmission upgrade after we beat Vic. Then we got brakes, and I think Suspicion was one of them. Suspicion. <laughs> Suspension. That that was not worth the, the cinematic cam. You know, sometimes I like it. Other times it just slows down the, the, the gameplay. Not nearly as much as the goddamn voicemails and text messages. That crap. I hate that stuff. But the slow motion, uh, it's good sometimes. So yeah, I saw on the map, we're right next to a sprint race. And we don't have any upgrades, but because the AI rubber band a lot, we're going to have an actual good racing for a while. So before I go making the car freaking OP and everything, let's just enjoy the rubber banding of AI. So we got to... Cadillac CTS, Mitsubishi Evo. Not sure what the red car is. Looks like an Audi of some kind. I wanted to drink my cocoa. Already scraping up the damn car. What's that red thing? Is that an Audi? It's, it's kind of small. It's got a weird rear end. Looks like an Audi TT, but with the body design of an Audi R8. I don't know. Oh my gosh, they're all just taking a shortcut and then crashing to the wall in the exit. Then you stop in front of me, bozo. I don't know what that is. The front end doesn't make sense either. Uh, I guess that's an Audi TT. The proportion is accurate. Everything else is kind of off in my opinion. I can't even see where I'm going. Like, I know the track wants me to turn right, but I all this sparks and mess in front of me from these AI. But yeah, we have ourselves a challenging race right now, but it's not impossible by any means. I mean, if I had NOS, I would just shoot right past this guy. He wants to take the shortcut. Oh, yeah, we're going under a water park, by the way. Not sure which water park that is in reality. I don't assume that this is really all that close to Galveston. Oh my god, we have a really terrible corner coming up. Stop, stop! Oh, don't hit that. And I I didn't hit it, but the game decided that I hit it. I'm I'm lit. You can see my car. What are y'all doing over here? Did you see my car was not touching anything? But the game was saying no. You're not going anywhere. What kind of bullshit was that though? 
they like I was watching the weather van push the uh, Dodge Caravan and then out came all the street racers we're still in last by the way and I'm not in last because this car is in stock basically I am in last because of the traffic and these godforsaken AI and then also the tr track is that was a terrible turn awful awful turn one of the races in this chapter of the game ends with you crashing head on into a wall unless you can help it but i've never been able to okay we're coming up to the end section of the track because i already know that a ton of races end right up here so let's get to the lead i can't tell that's an audi a4 or an audi tt but it, it's small but at the same time i'm pretty sure it's an audi i it's it's a mystery but we won first try but like other races in here will take multiple tries. It's just a, a freaking text message. Yeah, let's go over here. I think one of our toll booths starts exactly where one from the last episode started. Yeah, we had one that started right up here. And that is indeed where this one is starting. We did unlock a new area at the end last episode. We beat Vic and we unlocked Camden Beach, so I'll show you all that area whenever we get to races there. Another $3,000. Cop probability. Maximum. This is probably not the best time to be starting pursuits. Ah, how do I forget? The loading screens for toll booths are really... never really that long. So sometimes it just doesn't even have a loading screen. It just goes right into it. And I think the reason why they're so short is because it's not spawning AI. It's not loading up the AI and how they race at certain parts of the track map. Mm. I feel like it might have to do something with, like, reset the amount of traffic that's around you. Or maybe they also have to load up all the race information. And that stuff is just digital numbers and shit. So I, I, I don't know exactly what it's loading up, but it really ain't much. Everything else makes sense to me whenever it comes to the other events, because obviously it's, it's a bunch of different cars and how they race. So we got four toll booths in this one. I think most of the time we've been having three. But yeah, now we're starting to explore areas you ain't seen before. They didn't even show us this part of the, the game in the prologue or pro means after. Epilogue. Yeah. We have a slightly sharp turn right here. I mean, the car scrubbed off its own speed to the point where not really. Oh, and we got little shortcuts off of the side that aren't actually shortcuts. I mean, I might have wanted to go through that one, but at the same time, it kind of takes you off-road. These shortcuts, they'll take you off-road and not make the track any shorter. We got a jump right here, I think. Yep. Oh, look at us go. Kept it off the walls. But basically, like, these shortcuts, they go off-road, and then the, the the dirt and grass slows you down, and it's not much of a shortcut. So in the end, you just wind up driving just as slow, if not slower. So Some of them, if you can go through and ride the wall fast enough, you can make it work, and I couldn't change my line right there. I had to crash into that guy. It's like, okay, uh, turn underneath him. Car ain't turning any more than that. We need new tires. We need to stop missing out on the better tires. Oh my god. I need a better suspension. The car is not even made to turn that well. And our first pursuit with the Clio Renault. Kind of wanted to hit him and flip him over. Have him not be my problem. It is very easy to lose police at the uh, stage one, heat level one. Yeah, the heat levels. Is this the end? Yeah, and I'm crashing the barrels. And we got it with almost 17 seconds to spare. Watch, I'm just gonna drive in here. And that's gonna be the end of the pursuit. Oh no, they followed me in here, Never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about. We just spawned someone on the exit. Oh my God, I've never seen I'll spawn so many police cars. Where was this in the past three episodes? I mean, it's just heat level one. It's not any different with any car or any part of the game. Yeah, now I'm going in very obscure areas and they have no idea what's going on. Another cool cinematic shot. All these new places. 
new things to do and see. Okay, good stuff. Well, we got out of the pursuit in under three minutes. There is a cop over there. <laughs> I need to pack up and not get seen again. Because we have one, we have to make it a certain length. And another, we got to get out of there within three minutes. I don't know how long we actually have to be in the other pursuit. It might be like five minutes or something. Oh my god, shut up! It's your pal Razor. Heard you back in. I hope you enjoyed your vacation. Maybe I should call you sweetheart now, huh? <laughs> Glad to see you're a sucker for punishment, though. And by the way, thanks for the ride. Be seeing ya. That's, uh, that's an interesting gay fetish. When did we get this? We got two messages at the same damn time? And they couldn't show us the message... Because we went into a pursuit right after the race, I guess. Okay, what's up, Raj? Hey, I've been digging around and it looks like that Mia chick's laying a lot of cash on you. I don't like her. I also found out she has a real long record. That means the cops are probably watching her. I'd stay away if I were you. It means the cops are probably watching her. Maybe there's a reason why she has a really long record. You stupid fucking dumb ass shit faced cockhead. Get your dumb ass out of the way. <sighs> oh my god, I keep having to turn around and turn around and wait and wait and wait and wait and wait because stupid police officers keep on spawning. Every time they do that, you can't do the stupid photo ticket, but they keep on spawning police officers. No, go away. Son of a bitch! Now that the pursuit is over. Can you stop spawning traffic right in front of the speed trap and stop spawning police cars? Let's go, let's go, let's go! Hell yeah! Fuck you, EA. Fuck you. There's a drag race that starts right here. That was... What? Why? You know, that is not the only one that is that difficult. That would be stupidly difficult regardless what car I'm driving. It doesn't help that the speed they're asking for was way higher than any before. It was 121 miles an hour. <laughs> but uh, yeah, drag races. Where you do not steer the car. You just change lanes. And avoid getting told by crashing into traffic. I oh, mean, I clicked the shift up button, but it didn't shift. Let's pull out from behind this guy. Shift up. Avoid the traffic. Get into the far right lane. Now get into... The middle lane. Oh my god. Where are you going? This is why I wish I was the one driving. Oh my god, I barely won that. I didn't have NOS. But I do have the transmission. Good good transmission. Transmission is everything. When, uh, 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 drag racing. Yeah. Kamikaze said I should drive on the correct side of the road. Something tells me that is not solving my problems anymore. There's so much traffic that it's hopeless. Oh man, that's a paint job. If I don't get like a really cool jump shot, then that's probably the thumbnail. Unless maybe we get a cool shot with the blacklist racer Izzy herself and we'll go up against her. Could always be some good camera angles up against her. Okay, so this is this is a circuit race. We got two laps around all of this. And then them AI, they still do that thing where whenever they have a, like a 90 degree corner and they can cut through the grass, they just don't. They actually stay on the road. Now, if it's a shortcut, you know, like the, the red and white signs and like the green blinking lights or something, in that case, yeah, they, they will take a shortcut, but they won't like cut the road shit. I know there is a toll booth thing that I gotta avoid crashing into. Gotta aim it just right, even though I can't see where I'm going. There's a gas station over here. I would like to cut through the gas station. I hit the speed breaker way too early. Let's just make sure I get in between the pumps. Okay, good stuff. Got through there as fast as I could. We got a four second lead. That'll go away in less than four seconds with how these AI rubber band, to be honest. Oh, oh, 
Oh man, I really need the tires. It's one of the first things I'm gonna get. And um, tires really aren't that expensive. <laughs> I think maybe like some decent street racing tires or sports tires, whatever. Might cost like $2,000. I'm pretty sure we have way more than that. We started this with like 3,000. We've done, I think, two actual races. So that's maybe 9,000 something. Oh, he's coming. Ugh. I made him check up. I was trying to block him, but I don't have a mirror. Mirror. I, there's a mirror in this game. I've seen it in the PC version that Test Drive is playing. Um. Oh my god, that didn't work that time. Can I turn the mirror on at the pause menu? Or am I not allowed to do that on the PlayStation 2? Gameplay. Gameplay. Rear view mirror. On. I it's on, but I can't what I can't I'm not seeing anything. All I see is the ticking thing for speed traps and police. I guess you can't actually have the mirror on the PlayStation 2 then. Sadness. Sadness. I mean, are there other console versions of this game where you can get it? Ah! Man, I should have just gone to the left. And that's like a whole two seconds I just lost by trying to avoid that guy. Okay, so we have this blind jump up here again. Ah! Oh my god, I completely missed that. Yeah, I should know by now, after all these years, exactly where to jump and how to aim it. Here comes this guy. Fine by me. He's going to smash the brakes. I hit it earlier this time. Good God. Okay, here we go. Avoid that. Oh, it's getting all sideways. Good enough. Good enough! I thought it was good enough. Dude, how the hell can you come out of that section so much faster than me? Like, there's no way you can go up through there full speed with, without slowing down. Like, I, I don't... It makes no sense to me. Like, I made that a straight line. He made it a, a sharp curve and came out way faster. He didn't even use NOS. And also, it's it's a golf, so this game is just full of shit. Now he's getting away. The rubber banding ain't kicked in just yet. The rubber banding makes for good racing, but it sucks when you lose because it ain't kicked in just yet. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Come on. I'm sitting right in this draft. I guess this game is stupid. Let's go this way. Let's go this way. Stupid fucking mother shit. Oh, oh my god. You, you poor man. <sighs> About to lose the race again. Can I win and take the shortcut? Nope. Lose the race again. Oh, fuck god. Here we go. Still got that big lead. Ugh. Trying not to scrub off the speed. And I, I'm scrubbing off the speed. Ugh. Go. Stay on the road. Okay, we, we got this. We're good. Let's cut this part of the track just a little bit, like I always do. On my third try, I finally win this damn race. <sighs> Shut up! Hey, I heard you were rolling the streets. If Rockport is anything like this, you're going to have a lot of worked rides to take out. I hear Razor's been rattling a lot of people out there. I wouldn't worry about it, though. He's just trying to throw you off your game. Stay on target. He'll pay soon enough. I gotta hook up some numbers on you. See you later. I was doing that damn race so many times that my cocoa, my hot chocolate, is not hot anymore. So we're right down the road from a shop. Let's just drive over to that one. Hopefully a, per Ow. Hopefully a pursuit does not start before I can get there. You'd be shocked with what bullshit this game pulls. Okay, get on in. There we go! Now we get to look at this beautiful car in normal white lighting. There's a, a weird golden hue to everything whenever you're out in the free roam. So, let, let's put some better tires on here. And like I said, not that expensive. $1,400. So definitely going to get those. I'm either going to get turbo or engine upgrade. Whichever costs less. This is 5400 There's only one available. And the engine is 5500 And that's locked. So let's get the turbo. We'll get the engine part later. 
Because I want to save the rest of my money for, like, a better suspension. Yeah, and this is the only one available. I have, like, 2000 something dollars left to spend. I already have a, a transmission part. Um, I haven't gotten any nitrous. How much does that cost? I can't afford it. That's how much it costs. Okay. Well, I, I could do like one more race and I'll probably be able to get the, the nitrous. This car is going to sound very different now. <laughs> yeah. It's doing a little whistling sound. Ow! You people suck at driving. Like, I'm going straight. And you're just turning right into me. Um, let's direct the, uh, the map to game. Load up. To this this speed trap over here, the the photo ticket, you can get that one. Yeah, there was two of them. I need to get this one too. It says it's one mile away. Hopefully, it takes it to me in the right direction. That way, I can actually go fast enough through it. I've got to just cut all of that out of the video because it's just me whining like a goddamn bitch because this game has a habit of spawning all the cars in the freaking world right in front of me now that we're in this chapter and I don't even know why okay go fast go fast go fast I don't even know what speed I was supposed to be going but we got it I'm not stupid man they they're the, the GPS sucks they're spawning all the traffic in the world now police are after me and I'm trying to start a stupid race can I get a unit started up ahead of that way <sighs> That's the speed trap race. None I don't want. Not not yet. We'll do this race. We'll get some nitrous and then ow. And then we'll we'll do the speed trap race. Okay. So this 5.1 miles. I don't think for a sprint race that's really all that long. Okay, what are we up against? There's another guy in a Clio Renault. That's cool. Um, he is not using the same body kit. Kind of looks like he doesn't even have one. Oh, we got a Mazda RX-7? Is that what I'm seeing? And then... There's this other tiny car. I don't... I'm not sure if that's a Fiat Punto or a Volkswagen Golf. Oh, and they all had to stop for the taxi. I think that might have been an Audi A3, to be honest. I have no idea. All these, these small cars, I can't tell what they are. Let's drive on the correct side of the road. Yeah, that that's that's a, that's a big deal right here. Like the traffic's cut down for the race. We have more traffic during the free roll than we do during the race. I don't know. But you see, now we're not being as challenged by the AI because we got all these upgrades just thrown into the car. Um, we can maintain speed better, not scrub off with the freaking garbage tires. And then with the suspension. I think this thing steers better and it moves better. It doesn't have this resistance to steer, which also will cause the car to scrub off speed. Damn, this is just basically like an interstate event right here. I mean, I feel like we're on the interstate the entire time. Maybe some of it's like the highway. Okay, now we're getting off. Okay. It's like full throttle the entire time. Just some really quick curves. Yeah, less traffic. Oh, we got one truck right there. Any cars, game? Any cars? I mean, I think it's it's better to have more traffic during free roam than it is during the races, I guess, because it helps the race go better. But I still think that we've had quite a few races with a lot of traffic. I hate how whenever you want to do speed traps in this game, suddenly they just start spawning traffic right next to the area. Like it's a spawning point and a speed trap point for the race. This guy is catching me. Is it really just because I don't have Nas? God damn. Where is he? He's still hanging back there. Doo -doo. That's the guy in the other Cleo Renault. So it goes to show it's, it's a great car. Oh my God, this is the one. This is the one where the race ends with you crashing into a wall. Go ahead, let's do it. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Let's go! Ugh. Well, I don't know how that guy didn't. I guess because I ended the race, they went ahead and diverted their path and gave up on actually finishing it properly. I mean, if they were leading, then they would go ram into the wall like that. Now, let's just go back all the way over there and do the speed trap race. Okay, um... <laughs> I, I, I didn't even buy the damn knots. Quit the free roll. 
And then they all just freaking give up. So, uh, let's go to this shop that seems to be just down the road. I had, like, 2,600 after buying all those parts a while ago. And then I just picked up another 3,000. Okay, and we can get this dry shot of nitrous. Good stuff. Adds a, a bunch to our acceleration bar. And then, I guess probably adds handling. It helps straighten the car out. Know that much. Okay, that's all I needed for now. Come on, don't hit any trees. Ugh. 133, doing pretty good. Ugh. I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do about that. It's gonna lose me the race. Go! Oh, what the fuck? How? How? What? What? What the? I, uh, <laughs> I, I don't even know what the fuck just went wrong. I don't know how I fell to, to second, and then I fell to third. This guy passed me because that turn was terrible. So let's try that again. I was doing so freaking well. Yeah, let's save that NOS for a little bit. Now let's get on to it. Maybe that's better timing? Yeah, I'm, I'm leading. Same 125 miles per hour the first time I did the race. Uh, it would help if the freaking track did not end in the same garbage section that all of them do. It's so freaking annoying. And dude, I can't even achieve the speeds that I want to because these guys don't know how to race. Like, they have to stay on the road. They can't just cut the damn pavement. Abuse the track limits, goddammit. Street racers. Okay. I just used up some NOS that I could probably use in a few seconds. There's no one in my way right now. I'm in their way. Good stuff. Ugh, I'm, I'm struggling to go faster than these guys. And I, I got the turbo. I guess I need an engine upgrade too, because I mean, I'm struggling to keep up with a guy in a Cobalt. Oh my god, I got the tires. Why are we still sliding like this? Stupid civilian, get out of the way. Okay, use the NOS. 122. How are we doing? Am I leading? I'm trying to see if it's updating. It says I've got an 8 miles per hour lead. It's too close. This is so annoying. I drove through the parking lot last time and, well, I, I guess that wasn't the smartest idea. I thought I'd be maintaining speed by going straight. No, I guess they want me to actually take a hard right. Okay, let's actually use our NOS right here. Come on! Why do I hit the wall at the end? Why can't I just not do that? I'm so focused on watching the speed that pops up on the screen that I just drive into the wall. I should not do that. So, let's not drive through the parking lot. Just stay on the road. There's just so much shit to crash into, so I don't know how this would work better. I'm trying not hit the damn trees, but at the same time set up this corner properly. Okay, so I've still got the lead. I'm actually tied for the lead, but I'm ahead, so yeah, we will win the race this time. Good. They're freaking rubber banding, and like, I've got all these upgrades in this car now, and I, I'm leading like the entire damn time, yet somehow, I'm still losing, because they have to rubber band back towards me, causing them to achieve stupid speeds that their cars aren't actually good enough to do. I don't know where all the AI went, because that wasn't a knockout race, and they vanished. Ironically, we haven't had any knockout races in this entire chapter. <laughs> Which is weird because it said that was our strength. Hmm. Well, there's a toll booth, so let's go do that. Oh, it looks like JC has decided to just stop driving around the map. Well, the car's got heat on it. And I hate being stopped from running my races so I can go do a pursuit. I mean, it's, it's not that bad of a thing if I go through with the pursuit and, and try to accomplish all the tasks, but then it makes it difficult to, to get to the races again <laughs> once I've got the heat up even further by starting a pursuit, trying to do the milestones. And I don't know what the hell I'm going to do whenever I'm still driving this car to move on to the next chapter and I want to do races. I'm going to have to just go to them using the, the, the event collection menu thing, whatever that is. Gotta use that NOS. Keep it going fast in the straights. It's, it's another four toll booth event. And we were having ones with just three up until this point. Now both of them got four. 
I hate that I can't see the paint job on the car. <laughs> All I see is white, and then of course I can see the carbon hood, but... Man, now that I'm not trying to do the damn photo ticket or whatever, we we don't have all this freaking traffic right here stopping me. Call bullshit. Mm. Oh my god. I, I'm so used to driving like extremely powerful, uh, great handling cars, just the ultimatum of vehicles. But now that I'm starting off the game fresh, I have to work my way back towards all of that. Have these expectations to be able to go full throttle in almost every damn turn. I can do most of them right now due to the size of this car and the fact that it does have its its upgrades. It isn't getting loose all the damn time. It's a lot more sturdy. But I'm still used to having like the best tires in the game, and these are only like uh pro tires. Still gotta go through like three stages of tire to get what I want. And it's raining. I like it when it's raining. Watch, this car is probably going to take this turn way better now that I've got these tires on it. Oh, yeah, that feels so much better. So much precision. I wish there were cars racing around me, but then again, if there were cars racing around me, they'd just be knocking me all over the damn place. Uh, go around it. And, well, that was the end, so it wouldn't have been a big deal anyway. That's another $3,000 in cash. I'm kind of curious if I can afford to buy... A new engine now? I mean, I just picked up $6,000 at the last two events. There is a, a, a tune shop, body shop, race shop. What the hell do they call this damn thing? Good. Shop. It, it, let's go to shop. Let's go to shop and, and shop in shop. Uh, okay. You figure that would be the logical thing to do at all times, but no, I'd always go back to the exact same safe houses in the same shop, the ones right next to each other, because it felt like home. I don't have that home complex anymore, because I want to get these videos done as fast as possible. Yeah, it was 6,775. And we can't get the next one. So, yeah, we can afford this, we'll get that. Is that all upgrades? I mean, I'm not getting the transmission, I swear we already have a junk man thing for that. I can't even go back to the to the other side of the shop to see if I do. There's brakes, but like I rarely use the brakes and when I do they're fine. So I kind of <laughs> don't even want to bother with those. Leave it to Junk Man. Eventually we'll get Junk Man brakes again. Fucked hard. I think I've done all the race events for Izzy. Yes, I have. So let's get on to the milestones. I know we've already done the two speed trap photo tickets. I don't know what the hell to, to call them. There's speed trap photo ticket, then there's speed trap race, and the speed trap in the race. And uh, yeah, whenever we got out of the pursuit, and they want me to get out under three minutes, and then I was, I didn't want any of it. Got out of there so quick. Um, tag eight police vehicles. Damn, I'm gonna be to heat level two by then. I'll probably pass that. I'll be on my way to heat level three. Ugh. Trying to destroy his car as much as possible, make him spawn another police car. Come on. Give me more. I can climb this thing, right? Oh, wow. I I missed it. I'm I'm stuck. I'm st <laughs> Two videos in. How the fuck do I wind up in this place? <laughs> God damn it, man. Payment for infractions is now due. Um, just pay with a marker. Okay. And... I don't get this, dude. Like, it, nothing showed up there. I mean, it helps me get bounty having to sit here and do nothing. I could. I did nothing. I. I did not do that. What is this guy doing? Yeah, get get, get back over here. You crashed into the fucking station wagon. I missed that guy. You just crashed into him. Uh, 
can you please spawn another police car so I can continue to progress with the game? He crashed into the Dodge Caravan. Well, I'm glad to know that I'm done doing that. It is going through cooldown so fast right now. And they, they both killed themselves. Oh my god, I hate this. I hate these early game pursuits. I get busted so easily. I lose them so easily. Everything so easily instead of just getting shit done. Start it again. Start it again. Okay, let's let's go again. Ugh. Okay, we killed him. I will wait next to this guy. Where did he go? Oh my god, I, I just knocked him out of existence. I just entered heat level two. This is what I'm talking about! It's too easy and too hard at the same freaking time. And it's awful, and I hate it. Oi, 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 oi. Where, where's he at? He's over here? Okay. Come on over. I ain't tagged him yet. Okay, now we tagged him. You got another one? Okay, good stuff. More police cars, because we're in the next heat level. I got him. Let's go this way. Probably a faster way. Ugh. I'm trying to destroy his car, make them spawn another one. That's really what I do for it. If there's multiple of them, I want to get rid of one. Make them spawn another car. And I feel like they can't handle being around one another. That's also like another freaking problem. Don't crash into that. Don't. I didn't even touch that. I didn't even. They showed it as if I touched it. Now I have no police cars. Oh my god. You lost visual because you suck at your job. Why does it say someone can see me? Where did he come from? Oh, there's another one over there. Oh, this is good. This is good. They just spawned two more for me. Thank you. I like this heat level too. Okay, got him. I'm trying to hit this guy. Did I get him? I should have four now. Okay, we did. Why is this guy crashing into a building? <laughs> oh. The, the racing AI are good. All the other AI. Ow. I didn't even see that. Oh, all the other AI, they're, they're not really that good. Okay, let's... I want to hit that. See, they're doing that. Because I didn't touch it. I, did, I didn't touch anything. God. Go, go back over there. Go, go back over there. Hello? Hello? Oh, there's one up here on the hill. Well, there's that freaking pizza guy or whatever that I destroyed. You're going the wrong way, buffoon head. Ugh. Okay. Come over here. Come over here. Right, I should have five now, right? Yeah, we got five. I need three more. I'm just uh, stalling. Just driving around. Not actually going fast. Not actually crashing into anything. I'm watching all these police guys destroy water towers and, and construction sites. I, he seems to have problems keeping up with me, so I just turn around. Yeah, straighten out. Keep up. Come on. Trying to go on this adventure together, but you're too busy crashing into civilians and water showers and construction sites. Me, I don't even crash into anything. And they'll, they'll push me into something, and they'll blame it on me. I mean, it wouldn't be unlike the police force to do that, would it? Oh my god, this is a lot of traffic. He's gonna total his car right here. I mean, I, I thought he would. I don't know how he got out of there alive. Knowing these police cars, they, they just... I, I do nothing. And they give me the bounty and all that stuff just because they suck at their job. Uh, they only have one police car on us and I'm just sitting here waiting for backup. But in about a minute, we're gonna reach one of our milestones, which is make the pursuit last four minutes. Come on. He's back there. Oh, we got a police station? Where the hell are you going? I'm, I'm going into the police station. Somehow I'm evading by going to the police station. <laughs> okay. Oh my god! That is the third time in this pursuit that they have done that. Oh, we got a roadblock over here. Okay. Oh, wait. I. Where's it? Where's the roadblock? Dude, I can't even find the roadblock. Y'all took away the roadblock! Son of a bitch! 
Uh, it says he's over here. Okay, get him, get him. Yeah, make make some lovin's to him. Make some lovin's. Okay, don't hit the donut. Don't kill yourself. As much as I would love to see that happen again, it, it's scary because I have six right now. Six on the contact. And I'm waiting for backup. It keeps starting over because y'all keep killing yourselves. <laughs> This is just fucking comical. This is this is not the way the game is supposed to be designed. I swear to God. Oh yeah, we, we got the pursuit time thing. Oh my God. I gotta bust this thing up. Okay, we got ourselves a roadblock. It's going right there. Got a civilian car. He's gonna go crashing into it. I just destroyed so many of them. Y'all still following me? Okay. There he is. I already touched this car. Y'all should have sent another guy with a clean car from the roadblock. I mean, I, that would make sense. How many times has it rained in this pursuit? All I did was touch his car and it got destroyed. Okay. Uh, I don't know where this guy came from, but we, we complete the, the challenge. That That is all of the milestones complete. I need to evade. That should not be that difficult given how freaking terrible these police are. Come on. Come on. Uh, oh, let's... Hide in here, kind of, if that's even possible. Let, let's let's hide in between the 18 wheels. Let's just park it right in here. Ugh. 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 I can't parallel park like this. Ugh. I'm trying. I can't see you. You can't see me. No. No. I can't see you. You can't see me. <laughs> don't don't you fucking even. <laughs> I was about to be very mad. So that is all of the milestones, all the races. It's me. Looks like that easy chick wants to take you on. She's telling everybody she's gonna kick you back to Rosewood. I wouldn't let that stand for too long. Don't underestimate her just because she's a chick. That girl can drive. I'll call you after you take her out. You can't kick me back to Rosewood. I I will still be number 13. I already pushed uh, Vic aside. I am not even going to bother trying to drive to where her blacklist rival challenge is. Because I, I think we've seen how that goes. we got all this freaking heat on us right now. It's a sprint race and then a circuit. Uh, yeah, I already knew one of them was a circuit, because she has this ridiculous tendency to crash into medians. I was honestly expecting to see her just flying through the air after what I saw in, in Test Drive's Let's Play video. It, her car didn't spawn in the cutscene, right? Alright, let's go. I am going to save my NOS for third gear. And I guess she kind of had the same idea. She probably has better NOS than me or some shit. I'm going to cut underneath the water tower. The water tower didn't stop her. I really wish they, the Pursuit Breakers worked on the uh, the other racers. I think every now and then they do, but it did not in that scenario. I don't exactly know where this track is going. I don't have a very strong memory of the challenges against her. Because they're so easy. I remember them being easy. Oh! I remember this section of the map, though. Oh, hello. Why you... She hit me. And then she's like, oh, I'm sorry. And then she hit the brakes. I was expecting a toll booth thing to show up because I have no competition. Oh, my God. I go through the, the toll booth thing and then... And, well, there's just no one racing around me. I got a, I did a wheelie right there. Oh, there's a ramp up here. Let's go up the ramp. He's a NOS. Oh! Yeah! Got to see the paint job flying through the air. Um... Don't exactly know where I'm going. So many fences. Yeah, a couple shortcuts right there. Probably better for pursuits than actual racing with all the shit that's sitting in the way. Yeah, she's hanging in there. I 
I specifically tried to go to the right whenever I was already to the left. So I just gave the lead away. Got about a quarter of the race left or something. Come, come back over here. You suck. Suck. Come back over here. Yeah, my car just carries so much more natural speed for no reason. Why do I have to be on the side of the road with the traffic? What does Kamikaze He, he says drive on correct side road. Where'd she go? What, she just fucking vanished! I look behind me, she's not even there! <laughs> I don't know, maybe she hit one of the freaking cars. She she was on the same side of the road as me. Okay. Now this race is going to be more than twice as long, apparently. That first shot of her introduction was, was really great. But I don't know if it was, like, thumbnail-worthy. That right there might have been pretty good, too. I, I want to... I want to hold her up. We got a traffic car right in front of me as soon as we start the damn race. Okay, let's take the shortcut. She has decided she's dumb and not take the shortcut. Probably got better speed off of it, though. My car has a lot better grip in the grass now that I've got these tires, which is just insane. I don't know what kind of tires they are, but man, I got grip everywhere. Get out of the way. And I'm being a little more challenged by her than usual, but anytime she catches me, it's because I'm crashing into shit, not knowing where I'm going. Ow! Let's drive through here. She has decided to not drive through here. I gonna slow down. I hit the freaking wall. Trust me, you can get caught on walls in this game, because the hitboxes, it'll take your car to a full stop, and all you did was touch the corner of a wall. Okay, ow. Why, game? Why? So, you, um, gonna crash into that? Nope, not this time. Maybe she'll do it the second time, I don't know. I think at one point I saw her do it twice. So now I just kind of expect it. Damn, I pull away in the straights. I'm not used to them giving me a cinematic shot for that jump. But I guess I've just got that much more horsepower now that I'm driving this thing. <laughs> I wonder why this race is so damn long almost five minutes this track takes like two and a half to get around no 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 stop i gotta back it up ah it's fine little rubber band and whatever stupid bullshit here we come i wish that the draft actually did something here but as far as i'm concerned it doesn't my car can't turn any more than that. Ah, stop it, car. Stop it. Stop it. Let's use the speed breaker to go straight through the section of the track. I hate that whenever you go into the speed breaker, suddenly the AI just kind of deactivates and just does whatever you do. Maintain whatever speed you do. Maybe even go faster. Ah! Oof! She hit the thing. Nope. She... she did not have any mental issues in this race. That's unfortunate. I was always entertained by it. We still have like half the freaking track to go. Like I'm under the impression after that section that the race is almost over, but no, like I have a long way still freaking in. Okay, let's go through this section smoothly. Noss it up. Don't hit the weather van. I wish he had hit the weather van. Can we not flip over on our side this time? Okay, good stuff. I would love to use my NOS after smashing the brakes, but I don't have any. It's taking forever to load up. Don't hit the caravan. That's good. That's good. Thankfully, there's no traffic for them to force me to smash into. And it's raining again. So much rain in this video. Lovely. Ah, stop over steering. Oh my god, she's up my ass. That would be a good thing, but it's not a good thing. Turn in. Straighten out. Oh! Traffics! Traffics! Um, uh, okay. Beat her about maybe 500 feet. And they paid us off 8,000 in cash. Can I please have the pink slip? One time I picked the middle. One time I picked the right. The other time I picked the left. I'm gonna pick the middle again, just like I did last episode. Can I please have her car? Please!
Oh, supercharger. You can't put a supercharger in a Renault. Stupid friggin' stupid. Mm. Why can't I ever have the pink slip? Why? Like, yes, I shouldn't have picked the middle one again. I should have just kept on picking whichever. Um, why are we here? Okay. Well, I can go to the back room. Dude, I mean, if, if you want to be, like, nitpicky, I mean, it's turbo and supercharger, like, in the same category, but they're not the same thing. And it just says turbo. <laughs> Custom turbo. And it'll give me more acceleration, but, like, I think I want to just save this for a different car. <laughs> because the next Blacklist racer, uh, Big Lou... He drives the Eclipse, and the Mazda RX-8 is better than the Eclipse, so, like, there's no use. I just know that I would much rather save that part for later. I've already got Turbo in this thing, and it does its job, clearly, with us racing against Izzy. And I could probably already get, like, a, a better engine part, better nitrous, or better something else um, as we approach Big Lou and his lesser car than Izzy with the RX-8. I don't know if maybe he has like more upgrades in his Mitsubishi Eclipse that would make it better than her car. He might be a better driver, but I think she had a, Izzy had a good day for once. And they keep on giving me all these damn stupid bonus markers and it's always get out of jail for free, remove car from impound or extra uh, marker. But I keep on clicking use marker and then it never happens. None of these down here at the bottom are used up and I have one that I can add extra. I think I wind up using the markers whenever I pay with cash, then. Because well, I never pay with cash, I just go with the marker. Because I know a lot of my cars are temporary. I just, I want extra money. I should have way more than 9000 right now. <laughs> That's four cars they haven't given me. Test Drive's got way better luck with this shit than I do. See you next time. That's that. And episode over.